this episode of Philomena.com, I'm introducing you to one of the hottest designers in Liberia. Many of you already know who she is. You've seen her on CNN. You've seen her everywhere on the hot, like the hot list of Liberia's finest, rocking her purses, her designs. So without further ado, I'll introduce Wilhelmina, kind of like Philomena, Wilhelmina, Wilhelmina. Wilhelmina. <laughs> my Uniwe Designs is my brand. And, and I also have jewelry by my Uniwe. Right. right. This is new and, and see that, see that? That's <laughs> one of hers, that's one of hers. Got that today, got that. So today, she invited me to be a part of a photo shoot for an upcoming t-shirt line. You wanna get the full yes, like, rocking. These are all handmade yes. by Brema and the late Edward Lucky. So sad that I think you should do all my work for me. You will literally drop everything you're doing and go straight to whatever I had. So may just so rest in peace. And we started this. It was just because I wanted to wear t shirt dresses. There's a lot of t shirts here. I would really call some people who like make different type of t-shirts, wordy and stuff. I think like when businesses are funky, that's why the cover shop is wrong. Yeah. To have like all these businesses, especially movie businesses. But I wanted something that I could wear and be fancy, but still they didn't need to wear jeans. You can wear with jeans yeah. if you want. And it's very comfortable. You can still wear your new yeah. and you can go out exactly as far. And I wanted it to be free, comfortable, I think really good quality. So I'm like, okay, I don't want to be close because Spire materials, sewing clothes, it's another way of polluting the earth. Fashion is one of the biggest polluters of the earth. So I was like, okay, I want to do repurpose fashion, echo fashion, something that is already there. I take what is here, repurpose it, make it fancy, make it wearable, make it sustainable. You can have it forever. You can even tear it up and put it on your wall, frame it forever. It's real art, real painting, acrylic. When did you start it and why did you start it? Well, my new design is what started in uh, It's literally because I love fashion. I uh, was always catching my clothes that I've been tailoring in the garage. And I started in my dream shop. So, okay, I'm going to do this, but I don't want to do clothes as much as I want to do clothes. I don't really want to do clothes for everybody. Like, all right. So, what's the next thing? Mm -hmm. Accessories. My mom is buying all these ready made beds from Kini, the Zeta beds. And I'm like, I like them. But I want to make that to start. So I contacted one of them that she used to buy them and I made my own design. It was like, yes, we can try it out and you can see how it goes with that. So I started with like three bags, you know, blue plastic bag. We call it the blue plastic bag. Yeah. <laughs> started from the final picture. Now which last year. Year. <laughs> yeah, so we started with that and my friends bought them and then random people was like, oh, this is nice, we're interested in it. People abroad were interested in it. And it started to look like two, three bags and now we're so hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of things. My latest collection now is almost 75 different pieces. So we've just grown from there. We basically want to go over, want to shift everywhere. So we've been working, but basically it's part of the three things. Really special, really different, really sexy apart from everything else that's already going on. There's a lot of graphic and designer things are going on. But my brain is able to stay and give it every phone money now with any international brand because we're going to do this. Right. Very unique. That was my idea. Very unique. Well, these are beautiful. They're on sale now. I'm going to leave the information in this episode so you can order your t shirt, your bag, your jewels. There's a woman who does it all. And uh, we really appreciate you, including everyone, like you said, you brought me in uh, to do the photo shoot. You're using Liberian painters to do the actual graphics. I don't work with any foreign, anybody, everybody is Liberian, the people that make the bag, the people that go for the leather in Guinea. And if I travel to Nigeria, I bring leather sometimes and materials from outside, but it's only from the continent. Everything I do is made here, the suits from here, and only Liberians. Well, thank you for, again for having me. Uh, I, I, I can't wait for the pictures. We're going to look fabulous. Yes, Thousand Studios. Yes, Thousand Studios. Alan, our favorite Hello. photographer. He's Hopefully, yummy. I get my picture sometime. This is shade for this episode. Thank you. 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 Thank you.